The gym looks gorgeous. And it's not just because of the women. Go ding, spooky fans! Michael here, and welcome to the newest episode of my Pokemon Let's Go Pikachu playthrough. I hope you guys have been enjoying the series, and if you have, make sure to leave a like. Uh, if you missed last episode's insanity, which involved this little guy, go watch it, because it was crazy. But anyways, guys... Uh, if you want to pick up a batty bad to the bone t-shirt referencing Eevee's absurdly stupidly named uh, exclusive move, make sure you head to the link down in the description or in the cards or in the end screens of this video to pick one up because they will sell out. Um, but anyways, guys, uh, we're going to keep making our way. We finally got the Charmander last episode, um, which I'm not going to use. I just wanted it for the decks and stuff. So now we're going to make our way to... It's just a side deck. We're gonna make our way to Bill's house. Who do I have in front? Zor is in front. We're gonna put Sky in front. Man, <laughs> I was thinking that guy might have been a trainer and I had to like go around him to get to the Venonat and it was like super nerve wracking because I was worried I'd be in the trainer battle and then it wouldn't be there when I got back. Oh. Not a great matchup for Sky. It does sparkle. Okay, cool. Alright. We'll let Zor handle this. Zor's first battle is an Ivy Zor. I love how big Onyx is. I love it. It looks so good. Yep, good switch on my part. 10 out of 10, Mikey. 10 out of 10 Pokemon plays right there. I'm like still like, so I'm recording this like almost immediately after the last episode. And so I'm like still kind of like jittery after that, uh, whoa, what? Oh, the rage is building, I see. I'm still kind of jittery after finding that shiny because that's like so crazy. This is the second let's, of the three, like let's plays I've done of a new main series Pokemon game when it has come out. I've now found a random shiny within the first couple episodes in two of them. I only didn't find one in Ultra Sun, but I got one in Sun and I got one here in Let's Go Pikachu. And I'm like, how long will it continue? <laughs> Are those bird keepers? Is that, that's a bird keeper. I bet I can beat this person with Venonat. I definitely would need to switch before battling that bird keeper. Youngster Chad. Diglett! Alright, what do I got? I got confusion. Alright, that's unaffecting me because I'm using a uh, special attack. It does less than I would like it to. We need to give a. Uh, we need to get Sky some stab. Might just leave it in the party so it keeps growing levels until it learns <laughs> better moves. <laughs> I also don't, I, I forgot to look up whether um, Venomoth is a special or a physical attacker. Venomoth base. Oh, come on. Base stats. Okay, it is a special attacker. Special attack is 90. And I think mine has a special attack boosted nature. So that's actually really nice. I think it's modest, right? I think my shiny venom... I think it's modest? Chip summary. Yeah, it's modest. Wow, that's like the perfect nature. I mean, it's still a Venomoth, so it's not going to be that great. But like, that's still really cool. Alright, let's fight this bird keeper. It does need better moves before it's gonna, like, be able to battle against these random trainers without doing a butt-ton of switching. So I'm just gonna, like, I'll probably leave it in the back until it learns something better. Bird Keeper Joey! Pitchel! Oh! 
Oh no! Come on, buddy. Sand in your eyes can't lower your accuracy. Ah! But your eyes are made of sand. Aren't they? You're a rock. More little tiny rocks on you. It's like... Okay, to be fair, if someone threw, like, a bunch of dead skin cells in my eyes, I still would have trouble seeing. Oh, we hit it! No! Oh, why did I click takedown? I thought it was tackle. <laughs> oh, well. Oh, it hit! Yeet! That's awesome. I'm very glad that hit. <laughs> Pidge is level 20. Oh my god. What level are Misty's Pokemon? I thought they were like 18, 19? Or maybe they're like 21, 22. I don't know. Fight me, youngster! And then we'll put Venusaur in front. Or Ivysaur to fight against... Uh... Honestly, I should probably be putting Ivysaur in front. Never mind. Go, Gaia! When are you gonna learn a ground type move, dude? Other than sand attack. Oh, lovely. More wrapping. Oh, so close. Rock throw. One more time. That was a very sudden close-up on its face. The battles are so much more cinematic. I love it. So good. So gorgeous. Gorgeous, gorgeous. All right, Sky, you got this. Go, Sky! Shining. Okay, that wasn't too bad. We're good. Should probably disable bite. God, that does not do enough damage. Of course it goes for quick attack. Well, that means now it goes for Bite, which does more damage. <laughs> uh, yeah, you gotta, you gotta, you gotta get better moves. I don't know why I thought this was a good idea. I want to say the, the B word, because it, like, about to whip him. You know, it sounds like it just it fits. I can't see it. All right, Ivysaur needs to go in front. I want him to get some more. Experience. Man, God, there are so many of these trainers. Oh my God. This, this entire episode is just going to be trainer battles. This will be a very quick battle. I just heard, so Jubilee is streaming at the same time I'm recording this, and I heard her like get loud, and I'm like, anytime she does, I'm like, I like, end up like, you know, out of control, like, like what, what does she say? What's happening? And she, uh, it's because I, I don't know what happened. She didn't get a shiny. She was like, had to justify, like it was a worthy shriek, whatever she was doing. Should be the last one necessary. Yep, cool. Bye, my chap. Bye bye. Cool. I 
Sticker Knob. Right, is this a double battle? I'm not sure if it's a double battle or if they're, like, offset. Paige can stay in front. It's not. Okay, it's two consecutive battles. Definitely want to lure that guy away so I can go get that item without needing cut. Picnicker Kelsey! Hi, Kelsey! <gasps> Golden Golden! Golden Golden Golden! Aw, oh, man! Aw, oh, man! That stinks. We were so close. Come on, come on, come on, Zor. Come on, Zor. No! Crap, I need to heal. This Goldeen with its freaking pecking and supersonicking, it's just not fair. Need more power. Yes. Yay, you did it, buddy. Two great balls. Oh. Dang it, I can't lure him away. They coded it in. <laughs> Doom doo doo camper dust and he is a camper with but it is a squirtle. Well good luck with this, Squirtle. What the frick did how did that What is Vine Whip's power? Is it like five? It's forty-five. It's actually better than I thought it was. I think... Performance just have good physical defense. Jeez. I defeated a camper of dust. You suck. There are so many trainers on this route. <laughs> Fisherman Wayne! Well, this I know I can Oko with a Vine Whip. I know I can Oko this with a Vine Whip. <laughs> I do love Vine Whip's animation. Pa! <laughs> Alright. A Krabby. We're getting a lot of Pokemon added to our scene in this. Like, added to our scene. Not like... It... That was big. Like, uh, you know, Pokemon you, like, obtained and seen. We're seeing a lot of Pokemon for the first time on this route, is what I'm trying to say. Right, we beat Fisherman Wayne. Another coach. A lure. All right, we'll fight her. You gotta fight the coaches. They give you they give you good stuff. I need to potion Zor first if I want to use him. What up? So he's popular for dates. I'm a proudly independent coach trainer at a date spot. <laughs> I'll let you know I'm pretty strong. Want me to battle you? I would like to battle you. Give me something good. 
You come here for dates? Alright, I'll be your date. Kid, you're like 10. No, I'm a 23-year-old trapped in a 10-year-old's body. It's 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 different. It's fine. Level 16. Alright, we want to leech seed this. Boy. Boy, howdy. <laughs> I don't know how much Vine Whip is going to do to this thing, so I'm going to Leech Seed it and Poison Powder it. And it won't have Guts! For a second there, I was like, oh crap, it might have Guts. And then I'm like, nope, no, it won't. I'd really like to be able to beat this thing without using a potion, and Leech Seed definitely helps with that. Down. How much is this gonna do? Okay, a decent chunk. <laughs> Gives me a little bit of like, whoa! <laughs> Every time it does that. I think it like, I think the world that it shows, um, like when it zooms out is like Asia. I think it zooms out of Japan. I think I noticed that. It won't have another chance, because I'm fine whipping it, but... I mean, that would also make sense. This place is based on the Kanto region of Japan, so... Am I the one who was coached? Oh no, she's too attractive. This is not good. <laughs> Seismic Toss! Okay. That makes sense. She... We're teaching it to Mew. Mew needs more moves. <laughs> cool. All right, let's talk to Billiam. Cutscene. going to happen. Where is he? Where is the talking Pekka? Oh, he's a Nidorino? I thought he turned himself into a Clefairy. Oh, hiya. I'm a Pokemon. N no, I mean, I'm Bill. Call me Bill. I'm a true blue Pokemon fanatic. Hey, what's with that skeptical look? I'm not joshing you, pal. I screwed up an experiment and got combined with a Pokemon. So how about it? Help me out of here. I'm gonna climb inside the teleport so you run the cell separation system for me. You do it from the PC over there. You need to do it for me, right? Don't leave me hanging! <laughs> Count on you, pal. My hands are too large to type on the keyboard, and I also have to be in the thing to work. Alright. Is he gonna give me the Nidorino afterward? <laughs> oh, this is cool. It's a new cutscene, very cinematic and pretty as a hunt. Whoa! Just runs off. Oh. Swag! Yeehaw! Thanks, bud. I owe you one. Hey, you got your Pokemon box right there in your bag. Good job. You have a neat... Catch too many Pokemon and your box gets full. Send me some of those Pokemon. Send some of those Pokemon to Professor Oak. Let him be mighty thankful. Oh, look at me. I forget my own head if it weren't attached. I should do something to thank you, too. You did save me after all. Yeah, maybe this'll do. SS tickets. Yay. All right. What does Pikachu want to do? Oops. <laughs> You are so cute, oh my god. <laughs> oh, stop it to you. Alright. Onward! Alright, 
I didn't battle this girl, but I battled everyone else, right? How do you get the water Pokemon? Also, I didn't check over here. Oh, this is a shortcut back. That's right. Alright, well, I'm fighting last girl first, and then we're going back. Hello, ma'am! My friend has so many cute Pokemon, I'm jealous. Are yours all like hideous beasts? Do you use Jinx or Mr. Mime? Ah! Alright, we're just gonna switch. It'll take 10 years for Zor to beat this thing. Sky's actually good again. I'm not sure Sky can survive a hit if I switch it in now. So I'm just gonna potion it first. Okay. Now Sky can use super effective confusion and finally shine! Well, it already. It always shines. Because it's a shiny. A sky, a shine sky. Yes. Anyways, what I like about this shiny Venonet is that this is a shiny I've never like I've never gotten a shiny Venomoth or Venonet before in any game. That's still all it does. Okay, that's gonna do nothing. <laughs> Alright, this should KO. I think Sky's finally gonna get her first KO. Yep, there we go. Cool. Poison powder. Sure. Um, that's more useful than well. Accurate. Yeah, I'm never gonna use supersonic. It's too inaccurate. Poison powder is what? Only like 75? But that's still better than 55. Alright, we're gonna have to switch against this thing. Dumb. It's like mirror move. What? <laughs> but then it didn't have any mirrors to move. Or moves to mirror. <laughs> it didn't have any mirrors to move. Oh, what am I talking about? All right, back to Cerulean. <laughs> Sky's so happy. Look at that weird. Bug Bunny. Bugs Bunny. Oh, that would have been a good name for it. What you got? A Silver Raspberry? Where's the berry pocket? Catching pocket, that's what it is. Slightly easier, easier. Okay, all right. I mean, it's it does what I'd expect it to do. <laughs> Welcome back to Cerulean City. Tell the squad up. And I saw Joe Merrick tweet about Pikachu having an exclusive move that I can get before you battle against Misty. But, like, I don't have that. Where's the exclusive move? It's called, like, Zippy Zap or something? I should talk to people. Your 
Your Pikachu looks very pro can learn a marvelous move that I've developed. Yes. Zippy Zap. Cool. 50% 50 power always goes first and results in a critical hit. That is so freaking broken. <laughs> yeah, we can get rid of quick attack. I mean, I have a attack physical attack lowering nature, but like that kind of priority that's always a crit is going to be so useful. All right, can't go that way. All right, I think we've about covered everything. Which means I think we can check out Misty's gym, right? Because we can't get south of town until we've beaten her, right? Because then we go through that house that Officer Jenny's blocking off. It's the bike shop. All right, let's just go for the gym. Who do I have in front? All right, Zor's in front. Wrong building. What am I doing? <laughs> no, I need to go to the gym. The gym. I need to get swole at the gym. <gasps> Bikinis! Has to be at least level 15. Interesting. How could you possibly make it this far without a Pokemon that's at least level 15? The freaking... Oh, that's cool. The... How could you do that? Like, you gain so much experience anytime you just catch a Pokemon. And you like going through with just, like... Just... I, uh... Your starter? Maybe you wouldn't be a 15 if that was the case. Since that can't Oko. At least supersonic miss, I don't take any damage here. Can we get to 18 before the gym leader? Water Beauty Lily? Is that her trainer class? Not swimmer? Beauty Violet. Oh no, it's just Beauty. Interesting. I guess there's gonna be a different swimmer. Shielder! Oh! No thank you on the ice shards. No more of that. Good sir. Dang it! No! Stop that! Stop! No! Die now! Thank you. Goodbye. Good night. Sleep well. Oh, just noticed there's Squirtle art on the back of the gym. And Krabby! Oh, that's cool! This gym looks gorgeous. And it's not just because of the women. Alright. Last battle, we run back and heal, and then we come fight Mr. Mr. You see that dive just now? Don't you think it's deserving of a gold medal? Honey, I am not trained as a Olympic diving judge, so you're gonna have to ask somebody else. All right, seal is pure water. Hopefully it won't have any ice moves. And we outspeed it. Cool. Oh, come on. All right, at least it was weak. All right, cool. Gym trainer's taken care of. 18, we did it. Got to 18 before the gym. That's what I wanted. Oh, I just, <laughs> I just noticed those star use over the rainbow. 
Gay star use. That's awesome. All right. Back to heal. All right. Our second gym battle. Should be fun. Got a pretty good squad going. Won't stay like this for sure, but. Dun, 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 dun. All right, let's go fight these people. By that I mean Misty, just Misty. Misty's the only one we're fighting. Cause we already fought the other ones. What up, girlfriend? Hi, you're a new face. What's your policy on Pokemon? What's your approach? My policy for battle is an all-out offensive with water-type Pokemon. God, this game looks so good! Misty, the world-famous beauty, is your host. My sweet Pokemon are ready. Are you? Strike a pose, girl. Mm. Psyduck. She doesn't have Staryu and Storm. All right. If Vine Whip is a two-hit KO, then we're, we should be fine. Oh! Oh! <laughs> that was dope! Just boom! It's gone! I was not expecting that. I haven't. That's like the first thing I've O-coded. Oh, this thing's gonna probably hurt. It didn't use a Psychic move, so it probably doesn't know one. Cedar Dive Find. Okay. Oh, no. It knows a Psychic move. But Slide Wave's a weird one. It does random damage, right? It's not quite the same. Alright, hopefully we live this hit and then Vine Whip damage and poison with leech seed is enough to finish it off. All right, we should live this swift. Oh, that's not gonna be enough. I don't think it will. Oh, it is! Yes! We won! And we didn't have to default to our OP Pikachu! Let's go! All right, way to go! Way to go, V- or Ivysaur. All right, you can have a Cascade badge to show that you beat me. Hmm. Cascade badge makes Pokemon up to level 30 from other trainers listen to you. You also have my favorite TM, Scald. What? Scald this early? Teach it to a Pokemon that lives in the water? How about I teach it to my genetic crazy thing? Yes, you agree? So do I. Cool. Thanks for being on board. Goodbye, Pound, in favor of a base 80 powers water move at this point in the game. My gosh. I can't believe it's Scald. That'll be Water Pulse. Come on, there we go. We'll pet you in the head. Cute. All right, let's get out of here. Let's ski daddle. I'm very pleased that uh, I was able to beat that gym with just Ivysaur without having to, uh, without having to use a potion. 
or Pikachu's like OP as heck priority move. <laughs> Zippy Zap. Effectively a base 75 power move that bypasses defense boosts. That always goes first. Oh my god, that's ridiculous. Hey, give me back my po- Oh, Squirtle! Are we getting Squirtle at this point in the game? Or maybe not. Maybe it's just like a... Foreshadowing for later. When we get it in Vermilion. And I break into this house. How terrible. Someone broke their table. And these people just aren't concerned that I just walked into their broken into house. <laughs> Yeah, sweet, I can teach that to Geodude. He's like next to the house! <laughs> oh, so silly. Dun, 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 dun! Eradicate! Whoa! We'll just go ahead and find one yet. Two hit KO? Looks like it might be. It depends on the roll, I think. Ah! Ring. I think a package is being delivered. I don't need to answer it. Catcher, good level 20! Awesome. Alright, give me the dig TM and offer to return it to those people because I'm a good person and then not actually give it back. That's what happens, right? Like, if you go back and you can either walk off with it, but if you talk to them, they like offer to give it back. <laughs> Oh, video game excuses. All right, let's teach Dig to, uh... Pikachu can learn Dig? That is news to me. I love having TMs that don't break. That's like my favorite upgrade of the last several generations of Pokemon. <laughs> Aside from the physical special split. That's the most important one, and then TM's not breaking his second place. Right. Ivysaur's gotten a lot of reps. Let's give a... We'll toss Pidge back in front. Oh. All right, that tree... Cut tree, yep. Where are we going? All right, what's the deal with this daycare? Pidgey? Probably catch the Pidgey. Who knows how many Pokemon I'm gonna need to have caught for... How many Pokemon I'm gonna need to have caught for Squirtle? Because I have, like, just enough for freaking Charmander. And if it's gonna be Squirtle once we get to Vermilion, I'm definitely gonna need more. Quick candy. Thunderbolt at level 21?! Oh my god, this is the most OP Pikachu in existence. Holy crap. I can't believe that. 
Amnesia? Eh, it's special defense, right? Thunderbolt at level 21. That's absurd. <laughs> I should probably give those quick candies to somebody. Candy jar. 11 quick candies. I think Pikachu is a worthy... 69! I should give some to Mew, too, because Mew and Pikachu are the ones that I am, like, 100% certain are sticking around for the entire playthrough. Like, Ivysaur I definitely want to use a lot of. Um, but, like... You never know. Mighty Candy's physical attack, right? And we'll hold off on that one. It says Abra. What? Where did it go? It's gone. Is that how the? Do you have to sneak up on him? Is that what you have to do? That's annoying. Oh boy. I need to reposition my switch. Because it's very, super inconsistent with these motion controls, and it might be because my switch is over there. But, like, it shouldn't need to know where... I don't know. Should, the switch shouldn't have to be, like, right in front of me. I don't know. It's weird. Alright, we got ourselves a Growlithe. Cool. Eh. Grella seems like a high effort Pokemon, and that seems annoying. Oh. Alright, well, if it attacks us. It's huge! Alright, let's switch back to the regular Pokeballs. Oh, this one's easier to catch than the last one. Maybe it's lower level. How is it still underthrowing it? There we go. Oh yeah. I like don't even know what level these Pokemon are when I catch them. I'm like not even paying attention. <laughs> Self-destruct. No thanks. Every time my freaking thing, a freaking, every time my Venonat pops out of its Pokeball for like half a second, I'm like, oh. what the heck was that? That's such bull! I'm throwing it straight. Ugh. These motion controls are kind of annoying. They'd be fine if they were consistent, but they're clearly not consistent. I'm flicking it straight up every time and it's sending it over there. Catch combo of three. All right, let's move on. Is this just a single Pokemon daycare? A ditto plushie in the daycare! God, that's so funny. That's perfect. I love that. I love that they're just so aware of that. Yeah, it's like in Fire Red and Leaf Green. It's just this one Pokemon at a time daycare. So you can't breed. Pidgey and Rattata. Let's move on. Go around it that I don't need. Then use an ether. 
I'm out of MP. Then use an ether, but I... But you can't buy ether. It's the final battle, but I only have 85 of them. <laughs> oh, such a good prosy D mine. All right, looks like we might be about to battle our rival. Oh, hey, Michael. Seems like we can't pass through the gate there. Yes, I was aware of that. I've done this before. But the underground pass should take us to Vermilion City. It's a bit dark and spoopy, though. Huh? Well, still for one sec, Michael. Is he about to kiss me? I was wondering what that sparkly thing was that was stuck in... This was stuck in your hair. That was a weird thing. I know what a revive can do. Jesus Christ, what is with these extremely, absurdly generous rivals in new Pokemon games? I mean, I'm not complaining, but it's like, it doesn't make any sense. Oh, that's nice. I give him my extra SS ticket. Eek, you got it from that talking Pokemon? <laughs> what? It was a person after all? I guess that's good to hear. And just uh, forget about that whole thing, okay? I think I'll press on ahead. See you there! See you, dude. Dun, 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 What do you do? The underground path. Another repel. I can. Fi I'm finding a bunch of repels. I haven't found like any lures. <laughs> Men are not so happy. <laughs> Take the item. Oh, huh. Right as I said it. <laughs> Do you give me any free things? Alright, here we are! New route north of Vermilion. Round six. Jigglypuff. Super potion. Yeah, I probably have to upgrade to those now. What up, Jiggly? You ready for this? Ready to be caught, Jiggly? How do you get it to go to the side? Oh, I see. You just turn and do it that way. Don't, like, flick it to the side. Oh! Come on, I don't want to use any berries or great balls on this. I can catch a Jigglypuff. Yes, I can, let's go. access to quite a few routes. Alright, what else we got? Trainers. Multiple trainers. <laughs> Should probably chain uh, Geodude a little bit prior to the surge battle. Hey, mate! Mate! what it says. <laughs> this is actually good. I can... It's a good lead. Actually, Thunderbolt probably does more. Double Kick is what? Oh, never mind. It's good enough. What is Double Kick's power? It's like 30 each, right? So 60 total, I think. So 60 times 2 is 120. 90 times 1.5. Yeah, Thunderbolt's stronger. <laughs> Why, why did it give me Thunderbolt? That's so absurd. Another Growlithe. What else we got? Lots of Growlithe. 
Apparently he's a day he. This looks like a double battle. It's not a double battle. Like, they're lined up. Is it not like Emerald? Camper Jeff. All right, let's see how much damage I can do with Thunderbolt with a modest Pikachu with 75 base special attack. Oh. I want to try Zippy Zap. That's a dope animation. Yeah, this Pikachu's gonna, he gonna stick around because he is so overpowered. They really want you to keep it on your team. <laughs> what do I get new outfits though? Sky's up to 16, okay. Stun Spore. Sure, when do you learn a stab bug or poison move? <laughs> I want I want to use you, but you need different attacks. <laughs> All right. Well, let's go heal. All right. Caught a squirrel. I was getting into mischief. Thinking he's a good trainer. Sixty. Okay. Where am I at? 55. I only need five more and I can get Squirtle. Definitely want to go poke around on that other route to see what, uh... The route to the east? And also Diglett's cave. Get Diglett in the decks. Catch a Diglett. This is this still like a lot they're working on? Yep, yep, it is. That will never, ever be anything but an empty lot. <laughs> what you got? Hidden item or just flat? Oops. Just you like flowers. All right, well, you're cute, I'll allow it. Another coach. Pokemon are here. Drowsy. Sup, pal? Jubilee said aiming her hand at her switch made it, like, better. So I'm gonna, like, maybe try that. Or I'll just move my switch. I'll do it after the episode, though. I don't want to do it, like, in the middle of it. All right, 56. All right, we're up to 56 now. Oh! Do you use electricity safely at home? I would like to. Oops! Well, that's embarrassing. Man, this guy. I got an engineering degree, and I like to think I'm cuter than this guy. I should put Gaia in front. Gaia needs training before the Surge Gym. Come back, Pikachu! Chill, dude! Alright, don't care about light screen.
That was a bright attack. Goodness. Oh! <laughs> that rock thing that just came up. That was awesome! I love the animations. They're so fun. Alright, we beat Braxton. Let's put a... Uh... Want guy in front for sure. Ratata. Why are there only like three Pokemon in this entire route? Pidgey, Ratata. I I felt I thought there'd be more like. Another drowsy. Hmm. All right, well, nope. little underwhelming. Another big drowsy. Probably battle more of the trainers next episode. Let's go check out Diglett's cave for the time being. Who's this guy? Okay. I can't go back till I beat the Vermilion Gym. We can catch a dig level in here, though. There was one. Come back. Diglett. There you go. <laughs> I love it when they run in circles. Yep, throwing it toward my switch works. Need to move my switch elsewhere. There we go. Woo! Yay! Metronome! Sure, just for giggles. That's garbage. All right, got our Diglett data. I bet Dugtrio can definitely show up here, but like, I'd have to be in here for longer. Dun, dun, dun. All right, I guess I'll just catch a couple Pokemon here and... No, oh, what, no! You child, you have such good eyesight! Eh, it's fine. Youngster Eddie. Need a Reno. Cool. Alright, let's dig a dig a ton of dig dig a ton. Dig a ton of dig dig a ton of. Something something something. Dig a ton of. Dig a ton of dig dig a ton of. Oh. Glad that missed. We defeated Eddie! Suck it, Eddie! Alright, now let me catch this Pidgey like I was trying to. Go, got it. Oh, I got a nice throw! It's like the first time I've ever gotten a nice throw! And it failed, of course. It mm. 
just ran away? What determines when they can run away? What? How does that? Whoa! All right, come here, come here, come here. Whoa! Come here! <laughs> all right. Let's see. This is definitely not gonna work. Can I just? Or just? Mr. Mime! <laughs> That's my only silver raspberry. That wasn't a freaking. throw it sideways. Just wasting balls. Go back to the center. These motion controls are so annoying! Alright, I got a nice one again. Another nice one. Oh, I never thought I'd be that excited about catching a Mr. Mime. <laughs> oh. I actually got it. Wow. I was certain I was going to fail that. Oh. Oh. Where's that Pidgeotto? I'm going to get both of them, and then we're going to wrap up the episode. Hello. It's tiny. Of course it works first time on this thing. Ah. Can you buy raspberries? Go back to the center. All right, succeeded on both of them. That's awesome. Ooh, level 22, Mew. Amnesia, Mew. All right, guys. Oh. Our first pitch. Oh. All right, well, I should probably go back and buy some more Pokeballs. But guys, as I'm making my way back to the Pokemart and Pokemon Center, thank you. that's where I'm going to wrap it up for this episode. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you did enjoy it, don't forget to drop a like and make sure to pick up a Batty Bad t-shirt while you still have the chance. And that is all I have for now. So until next time, big fans, gotta catch them all!